When you're looking at products that'll be exposed to moisture, dust, chemicals, water, or any other undesirable condition, how do you make your selection? Well, typically we look for terms like water resistant, waterproof, or splash proof. But what do those words really mean? <laughs> I can't say for sure what they mean. So I always turn to the IP, or some people call them IPX ratings. IP and IPX ratings aren't two different systems at all, but rather are one and the same, expressed in two different ways. IP stands for International Protection, or some people call it Ingress Protection. If you see IP, then you know it's been tested and certified by an independent lab. Now when you see IPX, that simply means that that category wasn't independently certified. As you can see here, the first number after the letters is dust protection from 0 to 6. The higher the number, the better the protection. The second number is water resistance from 0 to 9. Again, the higher the number, the better the protection. As an example, if you see an IP67 rating, that means that it has the highest dust resistance rating and a 7 of 9 water resistance rating. Now, alternatively, if you see an IPX7 rating, that simply means you have no testing for dust resistance, and you still have a 7 of 9 water resistance rating. Now, as a note, you won't find any IPX9 or IPX9K rated products in our industry, because that category is used for industrial applications where the device would be exposed or submersed in very high temperature fluids. Now. Let's use what we've learned to select a product for our application. Let's say we need to select speakers for a paging system in a factory. First, let's consider the dust, or the solids, rating. We'll need to understand the conditions inside the factory to learn whether it's a dusty or dirty environment. And if it is, I'd pick 5 or possibly 6 for my dust protection rating. Now we also need some speakers out on the dock, which will be exposed to a little weather. So let's look at the water or liquids chart. For the dock area, we'll choose at least a 3 or 4 rating to protect against spraying or splashing rainwater. But they also want a few speakers for their parking lot. These speakers will be fully exposed to the elements, so we'll choose a 5 or 6 rating for these. So here's what we ended up with. In the factory, we'll use IP5 or better. For the dock, we'll use IP53 or better. And for the parking area, we'll use IP55 or better. So you can now use these ratings to select the proper devices for your applications wherever dust or moisture is present.